Hey, my name is Matthew Rollins with Anchor Bat. Today we're going to be talking about a question that some of you might initially think this is the dumbest thing ever, but we think it's important and we get asked this question all the time. So we're going to relay some answers to you. That is, where do I hit the baseball on a wood bat? And we know, oh my gosh, that's the dumbest question. It, it really isn't. And so many times people say, hey, how do I hold the label? Or how do I, like, where does the logo placement go? And what you're going to remember is something just simplistic like this, is logo faces me. And if you want to switch it up and you get a little bit more complex with it, you can go the exact opposite with it. But when you're hitting the baseball, you want to hit it perpendicular with the logo. With ash, it's flip-flopped. With maple, beech, um, yellow birch, it's, it's going to be the exact same. You want to hit the ball actually on the face of the grain. It's something that Major League Baseball changed a few years ago with a, a lot of research and study to determine that the face of the grain on those particular three wood types, maple, you know, the one that the majority of the, the market is using now, you want to hit it on the face of the grain and not, not with the grain anymore. So when you're holding the bat at the end of the day, yeah, you want to square the ball up. Yeah, you want to make solid contact and get what we baseball players call good wood on the, on the ball. Um, but at the same time, you want to make sure that the logo is facing you. So when you're hitting the baseball, we want to hit it right here, not with the logo, but rather opposite of the logo um, or perpendicular with the logo. So, you know, another question is, hey, you know, where on the bat do I want to hit it? And aluminum's much more forgiving. With wood, you know, once you get down around that trademark, the chances of you breaking a bat go up. And you know an astronomical amount and same thing if you hit the ball on the end of the bat in particular with a bat that has a you know a little bit deeper of a cup to give you a harder piece of wood um, which we talked about a you know a few weeks back but you know the ideal spot is the same as it would be with the, you know with aluminum is, is you want to make sure that you're you're hitting the ball on the sweet spot of the bat so not a dumb question it actually is a, is, is a great question in making contact, we want to do our best in the ideal world to hit it on the sweet spot of the bat with the logo facing up. Hopefully that answers some questions for you guys. Some of you are probably cussing me saying, no crap, that's the dumbest thing ever. But we get asked it all the time and just wanted to, to give you a little insight. Thanks again for being a part.